Good morning, guys. It's like first thing in the morning. <laughs> like I basically just got out of bed. Um, so it's way day. I'm nervous. <laughs> um, let's just let me not get my hopes up. But I'm seeing this with you guys. Um, I started out um, 208 pounds. Last week I dropped a pound, so then makes my current weight 207 pounds. And let's step on the scale and see what it is now. Come on, thing. Hope you can see it. Okay, I'm gonna weigh myself in another location and see what that comes out to. Alright. Barely showing. It's barely showing, um, but it says 208 or 207.8. So I'm very, very disappointed. Um, as you can see, the scale had a hard time cutting on, so I'm not sure if the batteries are messed up or if I probably should just get another scale because. I don't believe that rating, but yeah, that's what it is. So I was just talking to Hubby Bear, and he um, was just giving me a little bit of encouragement, um, and he was talking about the scale, like saying that he felt like it was a little off himself. Um, from the times that he's waiting um, and also you saw how I like struggled to um, get it to even turn on to read so time to bury it <laughs> it's lived most of his life under the sink so yeah a bit of proper bury <laughs> so yeah um, it, it's a little rough it's run its course it's we've had it for like years and years <laughs> and um it's gotten water on it and some more stuff and i know it's not waterproof <laughs> so um i'm just this is let this be a lesson to you guys to just honestly and i know i've done this in my last um journey and i don't know why i'm not following my own rules or my own advice but stay away from the scale um all it's really gonna do is drive you crazy and kind of um you know throw you off of your game a little bit and you're gonna be a little mad sometimes and then you're gonna be happy and mad it's just too much so if you know that you're doing what you have to do in the gym and you're you know eating properly and just be consistent with it and you know that you'll see some sort of change. I personally, like, I just told him yesterday that I was, oh, I see a little change. And, you know, I recorded a little bit for you guys. Um, I was like, oh, my thighs are a little bit. And, you know, my face, um, you know, seems like it's all sweet. But, um, 
yeah, just throw the scale away. Throw it away. <laughs> Have you ever watched? <laughs> okay. Have you ever watched old old like horror movies? It's horrible. <laughs> it's horrible. We're watching. Screaming, trying to move the wood, like oh, oh no, the wood is not going to move. Get out the boat and run. Okay. Yeah. Well, maybe she didn't. Maybe die. she was saved. I guess. She in the nut house now, Jim. I've never seen Jason's face, so it's the first. She going to the nut house. Anywho, um, oh, oh snap. Yeah, I'd, I'd be feeling the same way. Um. Oh! Oh, you know what? She did end up in the psych ward because I think it was another movie with her in the gym. Well, how was your workout? It was good. Got a headache right here. Oh, man. So, um, Hubby went to the basketball court and got his workout in for the day. I still have not. <laughs> I just ate my lunch. Um, so, we're sitting here chilling. For the day. Off me, dog. Dang, run up on me licking this stuff. <laughs> no. I don't want you licking on me, man. Who was that? Who had the door? Hey guys, so I'm, or we're heading to um, GNC. Actually, had the taste for a pizza, and um, I'm going to make some protein pizza with. The Quest protein powder. Um, I'm pretty sure you guys know about that. It's like the best protein powder ever, and you can make so many sweets and desserts and pancakes and different recipes with it. But I figured before I head out, this thing, this right here, you see that? It's going in the trash. <laughs> And I'm so serious about it like not only is it unhealthy to like keep weighing yourself but it's obvious that that scale has run its course so I'm done with it do you see my shoulders popping you see that <laughs> yeah. but yeah so I'm going with non-scale victories I am done with the cycle of weighing myself and it doesn't matter so the scales in the trash Ooh, look at these. Salted caramel and cookies and cream. I'm like, my mouth is watering. I'm gonna get the strawberry and peanut butter. Are you getting chia seeds? <laughs> Guess it's healthy. Well, <laughs> we just came from GNC and um, got some Quest bars and Quest um, protein packets. I was just like, from what you can see, I lost my mind when I saw all the flavors for the protein powders. I'm just like, <gasps> salted caramel and cookies and cream. Like, the fat girl in me was like real extra fat. Come on, Joe, come on, Joe, come on, Joe. So, um, me and Hope you're gonna split this one, and this is I got so many of them because they were like on sale too, which is rare. Um, this is the vanilla almond crunch one, and I'm getting a little hungry now um, after my lunch, so we're gonna I'm gonna eat this as a snack after this and make the pizza for like lunch, lunch, <laughs> and then I'm making pizza out of the. Um, multi-purpose like I had a big tub of this one and I got on clearance when it was about to expire so that was not the smartest one to make <laughs> ended up having to toss the whole tub of um, protein powder and that was not fun so I'm like now I'm missing it and I'm like oh I could be making like pizzas and all kinds of stuff with this pancake all that so I'll show you how the pizza turns out. I'm gonna make a plain um, cheese one, nothing special, but um, yeah, I'll show you. 
Hey guys, so here are my ingredients that I'm going to <laughs> make my pizza with. Of course, I have my protein powder, um, a pizza pan, some measuring cups. The recipe calls for um, two cups of part skim or low fat mozzarella. I have my organic pizza sauce here, and I believe it's low sugar too. Um, some Italian seasoning. And I decided to throw in this red bell pepper because I just wasn't using it and it was like just in my fridge just sitting there. Um, and then Greek yogurt. The recipe calls for um, garlic olive oil, which I didn't have. So I'm just going to use regular and I'm going to use some garlic seasoning in the mixture so I can have that garlicky flavor. And I'm also going to put garlic on the top of the pizza so let's get started so here's our pizza <laughs> it looks and smells so good I snuck a little bit of the taste of, um, of the dough excuse me and the dough just tasted so good too like by itself oh my goodness so this is our protein packed pizza um, and the recipe called for a lot of cheese two cups of cheese so I use that whole pack that you saw and I'm gonna cut this thing up and get to work I just took like a small bite of one of my slices and oh my goodness it is really 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 good like so good and you don't even like pay attention to the crust like the crust tastes just like regular pizza crust. It's amazing. So try this recipe. <laughs> you want a green bean? Is that what you want? guys so it's late again <laughs> um, I feel like that's the story of my life right now um, I'm done prepping my first meal and this will probably you know last me maybe a couple days this week and a day and a half ish um, what I did was I used the leftover uh, sweet potato that I made last night I did some steamed green beans, basically like I did it uh, last night as well, but um, I made some more of it obviously. Then I sauteed some uh, tri-colored bell peppers, just for a little more crunch and something extra to my meal. And these are beef patties, they're 90% um, lean grass-fed um, beef, ground beef that I got from the store. And what I did was I put um, some jerk seasoning in it. I had the taste for like jerk chicken and like Jamaican food. So I used this jerk seasoning here and just used this as my main seasoning with some um, fresh chopped garlic. I put that in there. And I topped it off with about a tablespoon of this jerk barbecue sauce. And this stuff is amazing. Like it tastes so good. And look at the calories on it that's pretty awesome to me because most barbecue sauces are about 70 calories for a tablespoon or more um, so this has a lot of flavor and I'm like actually excited to eat this tomorrow I really am so um, I did start because I'm making two separate meals I made um, jerk chicken <laughs> along with the jerk um, barbecue sauce kind of patties and I just did it oven baked that's Caribbean green seasoning with of course the jerk seasoning and um, some chopped onions scallions vegetables and I used um, I used chicken breast tenderloins so that will go with some rice and peas and some cabbage that I got from the grocery store that I'm going to steam uh, probably tomorrow. But yeah, this is 
I mean, you don't have to eat boring. This is some good tasting food. I had one of um, the beef meals tonight, and it was just, yeah, it hit every single spot. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. I It's it's really late, so I wasn't able to squeeze in a workout. I've been kind of busy today, even though it's a Sunday, doing laundry and just getting ready for the week. Just getting ready. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. Um, I'm going to do butts and guts again. That's like my Monday thing now. And I'm going to ask the teacher if I can record the class or at least some of it so you guys can see how intense that is and what we do in that class. So I will see you guys in the AM. Good. Stole Hubby Bear's Good. Raider Straw. <laughs> I reached the bottom of my gallon. What am I to do?